Matt Johnson with 60 Seconds with Sonar Phone. We've been bombarded with questions on rigging the high-speed transducer on the back of your boat. So let me give you a couple quick pointers here. For one, as you come in here and get a little closer, you'll see just a standard ruler, and all I'm doing is testing at what level this is going to hit the water. So right about there, you can see the tra transducer is hitting the ruler. That's the trajectory of the water. So you want it right about there. If it's too high, you might not get a good readout on high speeds. If it's too low, then what can happen is you're going to get that rooster tail effect and it's going to possibly break off. So make sure you get it adjusted accordingly so it sits right about level there where you can see water is just hitting the bottom of that transducer. And an easy way to adjust it is right up here. You can see there's two bolts that have the ability to slide up and down. Just unloose them a little bit, slide the transducer up, slide it down to get the maximum performance. It's that simple to figure out exactly where you want your transducer. So play with a couple of those quick tips to get the maximum performance out of your sonar phone system. To learn more, go to sonarphone.mobi.